Hey, hey, it's Krista Smith here from Activate Her Awesome. And today I am here with a video showing you how to connect your lead magnet if you're using MailerLite. So the first thing that you're gonna to wanna to do is you wanna to to come into forms and you're going to want to create a new form. And I'm gonna call it exactly what it is. I'm just gonna call it Stun Strategies because that's what this lead magnet is. And I am going to make it an embedded form. And then I'm gonna hit save and continue. Okay, and now it's asking me to choose who I want to make sure that this lead magnet goes to. So I'm just gonna choose this subscriber group. If you have a main list or a newsletter list, you would, you would choose the ones or all of the ones that you want it to connect to. And then I'm just gonna click the continue button. Now we have our form and I'm just gonna go ahead and make this styled exactly as I want it, which is I don't want any content on there and I want first name, email address and the subscribe button. So to add a another field, you're going to go over here and you're gonna click add field. We want it to be name. I want first name to be first, so I'm gonna change the order. And I'm actually gonna edit this because I want the first name to be required and save changes. Then I am going to come down here to the subscribe button and I'm gonna change this to send me the free resource. And I'm gonna hit save. And then I want to change the colors. So I'm now I'm on the design tab. So we've got the settings tab here and we have the design tab. So I'm going to come down to the button and maybe I want to change the background of the button to meet my brand color like that. And then I can, I can also change the hover color. Like right now it's going to hover to black, but I could change that too if I wanted to. Maybe make it a little different color. I can change the font family, the size of the corner. So there's lots of things that can change in here, but I'm really just gonna keep this pretty simple. The only other thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the background color off the background. So I don't want any color. I'm just gonna delete it altogether and hit save. And I want the same thing on the background of the form. I actually don't want any color in the background at all. Save. Okay, that's it. Now, the next thing I need to do is I need to go back into the settings because I need to click this custom success page because I want them to be, as soon as they put their name and their email address in, I want them to get that lead magnet. And this is how you do this. So what you're going to do is you're gonna come over here to your website. Doesn't matter what your website is, every website has a media library. And what you're gonna do, um, I'm using WordPress, so I'm just gonna do plus new media. And then this is where I'm gonna drop my PDF, okay? If I don't have a PDF, if I am redirecting to a video, if I'm redirecting to a podcast episode, obviously wherever, whatever that URL is that you're redirecting to, where they're going to access their lead magnet, that's what you wanna get. In this case, it's a PDF, so I'm just gonna hit copy URL to clipboard. I'm gonna come back here and I'm going to put that redirect URL right in there and then I'm gonna click done editing. I'm done the form, it's now hooked up exactly as it should be, everything is done. To put this on my website, here's all you need to do. It tells you right down here, all you have to do is scroll to the bottom. First thing you need to do is you need to copy this code and it needs to go in the head tag of, of your website. I'm gonna show you how to do that, it's really easy. If you're using WordPress, you're gonna come into customize you're gonna come into code, head code, and you're going to actually paste it, oops, in here. And I'm just gonna paste it right there. That's it, paste it. There's other tags in here too, that's fine. I'm gonna leave those and then I'm gonna hit publish. All right, that's done. Now, the next step is to actually take this piece of code here, boom, and then come back to my website and I'm going to open up the area where I'm assuming I want to add this. This was a convert kit form that I added. So let's just add another form in here. I'm gonna hit the plus sign and I'm just gonna bring in HTML. Or additionally, if you didn't wanna do this, you could bring in just regular text editor. So let's just bring in text editor. And then I'm gonna hit the general tab. You wanna make sure you're on text. So whatever you do, you have to be editing the HTML section. And then you wanna paste that code in there. That's it and you're gonna click done, and I'm gonna click publish, and I'm gonna hit refresh, and you're gonna see the form show up just magically. And there it is. So if we put our name in,
and hit send me the free resource, it should automatically redirect us to that PDF. And it did. And that's it. That's how you deliver your lead magnet in MailerLite. Make sure you hit me up if you have any questions. Subscribe for more updates. Cheers.